Hey everyone, it's Saturday and I hope you're having a great weekend so far. It is very beautiful and warm and sunny here today and I am ready for the day. It's uh, going on, I think, about 2 o'clock. Yeah, I think it's going on 2 o'clock. I'm not even sure. I think so. But anyway, uh, I'm getting ready to go out to town and uh, get me a salad. Giovanni's don't open till 3 on Saturdays, so I'm going to wait till they open. Then I'm going to get me a salad. I've not ate anything this morning or this today at all, and yesterday, uh, me and my husband went out for the day, and I do have a small haul. I want to show you some things I picked up yesterday, but we did eat out so much yesterday. We ate breakfast at McDonald's, and then we ate um, at Buffalo Wild Wings, uh, like for our late lunch. It was around 3 or three or 4 o'clock, and then we ate Jolly Pirate Donuts on the way home, and then between all that, I bought cookies at the mall. So, I told you before, I think that I was trying to cut down on my sweets. Well, I've ate so much sweets lately that it's ridiculous. But anyway, today is Saturday, like I said, and I'm going to try to have a low day today, even though it's a weekend and it's usually my cheat time. I'm going to just try to have a salad, maybe a protein bar later on. But I'm liking my outfit of the day. This is my leather cap that I ordered uh, off of eBay several months ago, not long after I started my channel, actually. If you'll remember, it was one of the first things that I showed you, one of the first hauls that I had. And then this is this little jump romper, uh, jumpsuit romper outfit from um, Kohl's. I'll get up and show you that. And then I'm just wearing my uh, silver Old Navy flip-flops. But I picked up a few things from Gabriel Brothers yesterday. And I have a couple pair of shoes from um, Playtest Closet and a wallet that I bought from there. And just some random stuff uh, sitting over here from the drugstore. Let me go ahead and get my wallet out. It's in my purse. I almost forgot about it. But I got this little wallet. I love it. Now, a lot of, like I told you before, Plato's Closet is secondhand stuff most of the time. You can get new stuff, but the stuff that I picked up, everything was secondhand. But I don't know the, the brand of this wallet, but I really like it. Let me see if I can tell. It doesn't really say. I love a big, chunky, substantial wallet, and I like just a basic color. Now, I've had red before, but I usually like gray, brown, or black. And you know me, I do like red, so the last wallet that I had before... Well, actually, the one I had before this was black and gold, and it tore up. I bought it at Plato's Closet, and I even showed it to you. It had the black studs on it, but it tore up real easy. I don't know. The zipper messed up on it. But I picked this one up yesterday. It's just a chocolate brown, and I don't see any, I don't see any brand name on it at all anywhere. But like I said, I like a big, chunky, substantial wallet, and I just give $6 for it. It's in perfect condition, and I'll pack it until it wears out. And I'm not a real big wallet person. I'll pack it until it wears out, and then I'll get me a different one. But the one I had before my black and gold one was a big, chunky red one that I bought at Goodies here in town. It was a very expensive wallet, but it didn't last but about six months, and it started the inside. The lining started ripping real bad on it. So I just I, from now on, I'm just going to go to play those and pick up like a second-hand one for 5 or $6 and just pack it till it wears out. Okay, I'm going to get up and show you my outfit of the day, and I'm just wearing my... Uh, metal, uh, gun metal hoops today, a very smoky eye, some new lashes, my regular lips, my nails are still painted in the um, Wet n Wild uh, One Step Wonder Gel and the Taupe is a Joke and it is starting to chip now and it's been on over a week, but I'll get up real quick and show you my outfit, I love this little outfit, it's very cool and flowy, we've been having some really hot days, but I love this, I don't know if you call it a romper or a jumper or gauchos or culottes or whatever, but my hair is clean. I washed it uh, the day before yesterday, and it's very silky and shiny and smooth, and I just run my straightener over it today. I thought about pull it back, pulling it back in a ponytail, but I wanted something different, but uh, anyway, here's the back of my jumpsuit. It ties around my neck, as you can tell, but it's black and white. I don't know if you can tell the print in it. Prints always make you look bigger and wider. I mean, I look bigger than, which I have gained, I'm sure I've gained a few pounds because I've ate a lot this last week or so, but it makes you look wide when you have a lot of prints going on, and I'm just wearing my, you've seen these flip-flops when I hauled them, they're just from Old Navy, silver flip-flops, I wanted some black ones, but I've not went back, back and bought any yet, but uh, I think Old Navy has really good flip-flops. Okay, I think what I'm going to do is just show you the stuff that's sitting over here. I went to TJ Maxx, and I picked up a few things, and one of the things was this, I guess it's pronounced Cherry Moya, if you've heard of that brand, let me know, it's a creamy gel eyeliner, and it says bestseller, that's what caught my attention, and it's black, and it comes in this little pot, you know what gel liners look like, and this little brush, 
This is absolutely one of the best gel liners. I've not used a whole lot of gel liners. I know the Elf, Elf makes a good one. That's one. That's the one that Hope likes to wear, and I have used it before. But this Cherry Moya uh, Creamy Gel Eyeliner in Black is absolutely uh, fantastic. I love it. I used it yesterday. When I bought it yesterday, I was using my Wet n Wild a retractable um uh, black liner that I showed you, but I must have bought a bad one because it did not have any pigmentation at all, and it was tugging on my eye, so I threw it away, and so after I bought this yesterday at TJ Maxx, I put it on in the car, and it wore all day. It's smudge-proof, waterproof, and it's a very, it doesn't smear or smudge, and it just comes in this little pot, you know, what they look like, and it is very intense, very creamy, and very black. And it, it wore well all day. But it's the Cherry cherry Moya Creamy Gel Eyeliner. If you can pick it up at TJ Maxx or Marshalls. Yeah, I mean, I'm sure you can probably find it online. But, um, it, let me see. Let me look at the price. It was, um, if you can see, it was $3.99. TJ Maxx is a fantastic place to buy uh, body care, hair care, uh, skin care, makeup, makeup brushes. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and put it in my drawer. But I've used it for two days now, and I really like it. Okay, and then, of course, you know that I shaved my face, which is good to get rid of peach fuzz and exfoliate, and so I picked up some razors. I've never tried these. They're Precision Beauty, and you get six razors, uh, six deluxe, they call them eyebrow razors, but you can use it on your face, six uh, razors for five ninety nine. so it's like a dollar a piece, and like I said, I've never used these before. I've used like the Stella razors and the Bella Beauty razors. They all come from TJ Maxx and they're very good. And I'm sure these will be just fine, but I'll let you know. I'll do a review on these. Okay. And then I also picked up uh, two sets of lashes from TJ Maxx. And they are the Ardell Flawless 8 801s. And this is them. This is them in the pack, but this is uh, what they look like on the eyes. I have uh, two pair of these. And today's the first day. I'm probably. It's probably an awkward position, but they're very pretty and very fluttery, and they were $2.99 a pair. So I got two pair of these, and then um, me and my husband stopped in at Walgreens. I'm not sure what um, uh, what order we stopped. I forget. I think Walgreens was first. Walgreens, I think, was before um, uh, Marshalls. Was it Marshalls? TJ Maxx. Anyway, I'm losing my train of thought. Okay, we went into Walgreens, and they had the Ardell Double Ups, buy one, get one free, and I bought a pair of my favorites, you know, the uh, 203s that Deidre had sent me, and then I bought a pair of the Double Wispies, and you know me and my lashes, I wear them every day, and I forgot to bring my skincare in here. I also picked up a jar of the um, 31... Uh, beauty studio beauty alpha hydroxy cream i think it's only like a seven percent hydroxy aha cream and um, the reason i did that is i'm completely out of aha and i have tried every ulta uh, in our area and they have quit selling the alpha skincare but i can order it online and i will eventually but i was completely out of skin cream so and i only use my retin-a every other night or every few nights even i'm starting to get real crinkly and peeling again and flaky, so I'm going to hold off. I used Retin-A a couple times last week, and now I'm going through the peeling, flaking stage, and I'm real crinkly around my eyes, so I'm going to hold off on it for a few days, and when I do that, I like to have a skin cream or serum, and I was completely out, so I went to Walgreens, and I picked up the, uh, I think it's Studio 31 or something, uh, Alpha Hydroxy Cream, and I will use that until I repurchase my Alpha Skin Care. But I picked up that cream, and I'll show it to you later. Everybody knows. It comes in like a little round jar, and you screw the lid off, and it's just a white, creamy cream. A lot of people know about it. It's like $10 a jar. When I first started buying it years ago, it was only like 6 or $7, but now they've upped the price to $10. But I picked up that um, cream and these two um, pairs of lashes, and I picked up my favorite um, pantyhose. You know, I, I told you I wear pantyhose. And I've never showed you these before, and I've worn them for years. But what was so special about this pair is they've come out with a uh, run stopper, I guess, because they do. They'll wear real good, and they support you real good, but they will get runs in them real easy. But now they've come out with some new technology, so we'll see how that works. And it's called Run Stopper, No Nonsense, Great Shapes. And I get size B in uh, best, um, 
beige mist, mist, <laughs> beige mist, and it's called the All Over Shapers, and uh, these are like uh, seven ninety nine, but they're well, well worth, it, especially if um, it'll stop runs, cause I'll be able to wear these for a couple of months, and then when it loses its support, I always go and buy another pair. And I'm having to, I should have raised my camera up. I forget that every time, and I'm having to bend over, and it's cutting the top of my head off. But I love these. If you do like pantyhose, and I know pantyhose are not for everyone, but I've worn them for years, and I like the feel of them, which I don't have them on today. But most of the time, I do wear support hose under my clothes. It just makes everything feel more firm and secure. But if you if you do like penny hose, try the no nonsense all over shapers. You'll really like them. Okay, that was everything that I picked up at like the drugstore and TJ Maxx. Uh, me and my husband had went to Gabriel Brothers, and um, I picked up a few tops in there. And I love this one. Look at this. This was one of the first ones that I seen, and it's got a split in the back. So of course I'd have to wear a cami under it, which I always do. But I love the sleeves in this. I've seen a lot of these blouses on Pinterest and in uh, fashion magazines, but the brand is Live and Truth, and it was $15.99, if you can tell, but I'm excited to wear this. I love this. I've got so many white blouses, and it hangs a little bit longer in the back, but what sold me on this blouse was definitely the sleeves, but that was the most expensive thing that I got engaged. Everything else was on clearance. Okay, I picked up this little cold shoulder, uh, light baby blue. I don't know how you can see how, how well you can see. It's a powder blue, cold shoulder lace top, and the brand is Allison. Let me see, Allison Andrews. So I've never heard of that, but I think that is so pretty. They did not have this in a small, and I liked it so well. And I've not tried any of these on, but I liked it so well that I went ahead and bought it in medium because I do think that it'll work. But uh, it was more, it was regularly twelve ninety nine, which is not a bad price at games. But it was marked down on clearance for four dollars. But I think that is so pretty. You know me and my coat shoulders. I love that. I'll be excited to wear that. Okay, and the next uh, shirt is just a t-shirt, a little bit distressed around the collar. Just says New York City or NYC, and it's like a real thin. I don't know if you can tell how thin and comfortable it is. But it was, uh, it's a Carly, K-A-R-L-I-E brand, and it was regularly $7.99, but they had it marked down to $2. They had a really big clearance sale yesterday at Gabriel Brothers. So if you do, if you, you shop at Gabe's or Gabriel Brothers, uh, if you have one near you, you need to check it out. They got a lot of clearance right now. But that'll be cute with just anything. And then I picked up. This little pink blouse, and as you can see, it's got the distressing or the little rip around the collar. I love that look. And all these uh, t-shirts are real thin. I'll definitely have to wear something under them. But it's a real pretty pink, peachy pink color, and it's the Carly brand also, just like the black tee. And it was regularly $7.99, and it was marked down to $2. But I think that's going to be so cute. I'll probably just tuck part of it in my jeans and leave part of it hanging out. But I think that's so cute. I'm going to wear this soon. I thought about wearing this today, but I wanted to put on something comfortable and flowy today. And then the last thing was just another top like the pink one, Carly brand. $7.99 marked down to two, and it's just the white one. And if you can see how thin they are, all of them's real thin and cool. But it's got the, the rip around the, the collar and just real cute. For $2 a piece, you know, you can't beat that if you just wear it once or twice. But that is my small haul. That's all that I got. No, 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 no. I almost forgot my main thing. I had seen these boots. I went to play doh's When was it? Was it day before yesterday by myself? I went to play doh Play doh's yesterday or day before yet. I went to play doh's two times in the past few days. I don't know what order or what days. I do know I went yesterday and picked my boots up. But then I either went the day before that or the day before that. I've lost track of time. But the first time I went by myself, I picked up these white leather. Converse, you know, I've been wanting some Converse, and um, these are the leather ones with the black strings, and they were a size seven. My foot has shrunk. I used to wear like a nine, eight and a half, and a nine, but now I can wear a seven, seven and a half. Eights are way too big, but they're just white leather. They need wiped off. I should have cleaned them off before I got on, but uh, they don't look like they've been worn much at all. They're very good. They're good shape, but they're the white leather with the black strings. And they were $18. I don't know if you can see. 
But that is a really good deal on Converse, because what are they, 50, 60 bucks? And with the leather ones, they may be more than that, but these are the leather ones, they're not the canvas ones. And I really like those. Well, when I was there that day, I was low on money, and I seen these boots, and I had to pick between the boots or the shoes that day. And so I picked the shoes, because you know, I, uh, you know I've been wanting some Converse, and I do love these. But I seen the boots, so when me and my husband went out yesterday, I told him I wanted to swing back by there. And I had seen that wallet, too, the day before that. So I told him, I said, there's a pair of boots and a wallet at Plato's I want to go buy and pick up. So he took me the, uh, he took me there and dropped me off yesterday. And I run in, and I already showed you the wallet. And you remember the white boots that I went so crazy about several months ago? I found them in pink. Look at this, you guys. Is these not gorgeous? Let me get the white ones. These are the white ones. Now, I paid 50 for these because they were brand new. They had never been worn, but I paid 25 for these, and there's not much difference in the quality. Look at this. Are they not so cute? It is what they, the brand is Airwick, A-I-R, no, Airwear, A Airwear, A-I-R-W-A-I-R, Airwear. But are those not so cute? I will have so much fun. These are heavy-duty boots. And I could wear them now, but my feet would get so hot. I'm going to wait till fall, but I am going to have so much fun with these boots. But are they not cute? I'd like to have them in a red pair. I may get online just to see how many colors you can get, but I love my boots. But uh, I had seen those and had to go back and get them. But that is everything that we picked up yesterday, and I picked those uh, commerce up a couple days ago. But I will let you guys go and enjoy your Saturday. It's already over 15 minutes, so I'm not going to be able to edit. So you will see me cutting my camera off. But you guys have a great Saturday. I may talk to you sometime tomorrow, and I'll definitely talk to you next week. So God bless you, and have a great weekend. Bye-bye.